Welcome back to Space Engineers, folks. I have completed the fighter, for now at least. Uh, it's not the prettiest ship in the world, but it's a ship. And calling it ugly hurts its feelings, so don't do that. Uh, so yeah, we have a fighter of sorts. It has four Gatling guns on it. And we have some ammo, and there is a supply chain transport right there. So I want to go and try and fight. Uh, I'm not shooting. There we go. All right. Let's go try and fight. I have made a blueprint of this, I hope. Uh, I'm not actually sure, because... Well... We, if I just jump out real quick, we're not moving now. So I do uh, control B, and there's a blueprint. So I hope that it's in my cloud. So, yeah, let's try and catch this supply transport and see if we can take it down. I think that could be kind of fun. Our very first fight in Space Engineers, and I think we need to get to around a kilometer before we can start shooting. Ooh, pretty. There, look. One of the other planets, I don't know which one. Okay, we are getting in range. And we are firing. Are we hitting? I have no idea. Something is hitting us. Jesus. Ah, get out of here. Are we still flying? We are. I think we're going down. We are going down. Let's try it. Oh. We are going down fast. Well, let's... All right, let's bail out. Oh. Okay, bailing out didn't help. <laughs> okay, our body is over here. Let's go have a look at our poor little fighter. That was a very unsuccessful first uh, fight. If I do say so myself. Uh, let's start by picking up our body. Jesus. I did not think it would be that hard. What's broken on this? Well, both our vertical thrusters are broken. One of our forward thrusters is gone. The other one looks like it's not too well off. Two of our side thrusters are gone there. All of them are gone there. Cockpit still exists, so I guess we would have survived if I'd stayed in there. Oh yeah, huh. That's not so good. We still have some power in it. I guess we do. Yeah, we do. So if we can fix it up, we can use it again. Let's, I, I want to go, I want to go have a look at this thing. Let's get our rifle out. I want to see if I did any kind of damage to it. So I'm going to try and zigzag my way up to it and try and not get hit. Well, oh, it's shooting at us. It's shooting. I think we did some kind of damage to it.
Doesn't it look like something is burning? Where's where where's it shooting from? Okay, never mind. Doesn't matter where it's shooting from. I think we did some kind of damage, but I am absolutely not sure. Oh, our body is coming down to the ground. Hello, buddy. <laughs> oh, well. Jeez, it's flying. Come here. Where are you going? We're almost out of hydrogen. Yeah, yeah. Come on, stop. Okay, we'll pick all this stuff up again. Alright, so... Fighting is harder than I thought it would be. But at least we had a, some kind of taste of it. Apparently... Approaching from below certainly isn't good. Maybe we need to approach from above or behind or something. I'm guessing. Well, we're going to have to figure it out. But we tried, we failed, and we will try again at some other point. Uh, maybe I should... Where... Damn it. I forgot to mark where the ship is, and I didn't put a beacon on it. I see something like on fire over here. Yeah. There it is. Let's jump in and just turn off everything that we don't need right now. And... Take down a GPS. Uh, poor little fighter. Oh, stupid caps lock. Poor little fighter. Oh, that was funny. <laughs> that was very, very funny. All right. So we might be able to fix it up. Uh, we're not going to do it right now. I'll leave the power going on it. It should have power for uh, quite a while. I forgot to look, but it should have power for quite a while. So... Yeah. That happened. Maybe four Gatling guns isn't enough. Maybe four Gatling guns isn't enough. Well, since we lost our little fighter that we have spent a long time building and we lost it in a few seconds, a lot of fun there, uh, we are going to, I think, where they, where's the O2? I think we're going to do a bit of welding on our base. Because we do have quite a lot of stuff. So if we jump into our welder ship here. And look at the inventory. Then if we search for. Uh, let's say steel plate. We have 64,000 steel plates. And we have more than that I think. Right, so since large container seven. So if we just say cargo, and we'll at least only see the cargo containers, we can grab some steel plate. We can grab some more steel plate. And we can grab some metal grids. We also have a few of 
there. And I think we'll actually grab some more grids and stick them in the cockpit. So where are the grids? There they are. Cockpit. There's our connector, which can also carry stuff, and the welders. So we'll stick some of those in the connector, and then we will stick some more two plates in the cockpit, if I can find it. But we could also do the welders. Let's just stick some in the welders. Hopefully we can fly with all this on, on us. Uh, we'll fill up completely in the welders and forget about the cockpit and we'll go try and get as much as we can of this belt base welded up and ready to go so batteries on auto arrows on thrusters on welders on and disengage and we are going down. Uh, we went down. We were too heavy. Can we lock? Or at least stop? Stop! Uh, okay, we locked. Okay! That was a bit too much weight. That was a bit too much weight. Doesn't look like we took any damage, really. But we are going to have to <laughs> get some of all of this weight out. And we will have to do it a little bit at a time. <laughs> well, this episode is going really well so far. We lost our fighter within seconds of uh, completing it. We... put too much stuff in the welder and that went down and um, yeah we're we're doing really well <laughs> now we're low on energy as well and we don't need to have our helmet closed Let's just, we can get some energy in the fighter here, or the, um, there we go. Let's get some more. I think we need to take out probably everything from the welders. Let's just fill the cargo containers up, and then we will grab everything else. And... Okay, man, it sucked that we couldn't take that supply transport. I have no idea how difficult a supply transport is supposed to be, but that one was certainly more that we could handle than with our tiny little fighter. Can we just, just double click? It's easier. Oh, here comes the sun. Let's actually, while the sun is coming up, where is it coming up? Where is it? Here comes the sun. Where is it? Shining on that, so it must be over there somewhere. Actually, it's shining on all of that. Where the heck is the sun? I have no idea. Never mind. We'll figure it out. Just wanted to see where uh, it would be best to put solar panels on the base. Uh, since we can't see the sun yet, I am just going to ignore it for now. Okay. Get you in there. So... 
let me know what you think was wrong with the fighter. Um, because obviously it uh, did not do what it was supposed to do. Uh, and it was much less survivable than I would have thought because I had armored it up pretty well. Though in in heavy armor blocks, but a small grid, so there isn't that much materials in them, but... Still, I would have thought that our little fighter would have held its own at least a little bit better. That would have been my thought, but apparently not. So if you have any experience with uh, combat in space engineers, with uh, small fighter ships and stuff like that, I would love to hear your thoughts on how we can improve that, because this is going to be a rough game if that's going to happen every time. I'm thinking maybe we need to go large grid and maybe go with instead of the Gatling guns that we have to aim ourselves we could uh, stick a bunch of turrets on like we had on, have on the roof of the base and then we could maybe do something with that that would be kind of nice Let's try and see if we can fly now. Nope. No dice. Uh, our... No, our thrusters are fine. Are they on, though? Uh, yeah, they look on to me. Are the forward thrusters on? A little bit hard to tell. Let's just jump into the cockpit and see a large on, 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 on. Okay. Okay. So I guess we need to get some more stuff out of here. I know that we can take off with at least two full con cargo containers. Maybe three is just a little bit too much. And the welders as well. Because I basically filled up three car cargo containers with stuff and three welders. And the cargo containers and the welders can contain the same amounts. So six cargo containers full of of stuff was apparently a little bit too much for welder ship. Hopefully we will be able to get it off the ground pretty soon. You know what, let me empty out the welder, the welders here and get to the point where we can take off and then I'll be back. Uh, see you in a few guys.
All right, so I have edited out, or I have uh, emptied out all of the welders. So here is the moment of truth, and we fly. And the answer seems to be no. Why the hell not? Whoa. That's okay. We're in a bit of a precarious position. Uh, let's take a look here and see is anything broken? Doesn't look like it. The thrusters are on, uh, all the other thrusters are on. The batteries are on. The gyroscopes are on. Hmm. Okay, I guess we are getting some more stuff out of here. Let's empty out the connector. See if that helps. Maybe I should slap some more engines on there. Not like it would ruin the aesthetics or anything. Because there are no aesthetics uh, on this craft. Uh, connector. So I emptied out 33,000, uh, 34,000 steel plates. And still. We're too heavy. I did stick a reversing camera on there, which I need to put on my hotbar. Okay. I'm guessing this is not enough, but we're going to give it a go. Uh, two. Let's no 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 stop lock did we break anything this time? No no you're all fine. I don't get it. Well I guess we are emptying out some more stuff. Let's empty out another cargo container. I'm sorry about this, guys, uh, but it is what it is. Accidents happen, and sometimes you screw up. Uh, and, uh, I certainly did in on this occasion. I really wanted to get some welding done now that the fighter is basically gone. We're gonna have to go save that as well. At least the ammo. I, I want all the materials as well. Uh, there's quite a lot of materials in there. So I think I'm gonna try and fix it up and get it back home. It's a long way away, though. So I think uh, I think I'll actually go there in the welder ship and try and weld it up a little bit. If I ever get this welder ship off the ground again, because it certainly doesn't seem like it right now. I know I've flown with a full container of. Uh, metal grids and a full container of steel plates before it. That is 100% for sure. So if that doesn't work, then something weird is going on. And I might have wasted my time. Uh, but I hope not. 
Let's give this a shot again. We just want to go forward. And we are not moving in the least. So weird. Ah! I think we lost a welder there. No, we didn't actually. We're fine. We're fine. I don't want to be in front of the engines. You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. It's really, really odd to me that we can't even lift off. I mean, come on. Every time we try, we have to go even further away to get the rest of the stuff out of this thing. Ah, so frustrating. Oh well. Almost there. I am 100% sure that I have taken off and flown around in that craft with two full containers of stuff. One of steel plates and one of... Uh, what's the, what are they called? Middle grids. That's absolutely 100% certain. So, if I can't do that now, I don't know what to do. Um, let's get some O2. There we go. Let's jump in. We have batteries for three days. So, that's not the problem. Let's see. Oh, we're kind of holding. Oh, we're going up. We're going up. Slowly. We are going up. Let's... Okay. Climb, 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 climb. I think we need a couple more engines on this. Maybe. Alright. We are in the air. And now we're not... Man. This thing is heavy, apparently. 281,000 kilos. I mean, the mining ship can handle that without any trouble, and it has the exact same engines. What the heck's going on? We can hold still. As soon as I go forward, we start dropping down. That's very, very odd to me. Very, very odd. Come up some more. Forward a bit. Where's... 
There, we're welding. So, as we weld here, it should get better. I think one of our tarts shot one of our railings off here. Looks like it. So we are welding. You know Let's just hold still for a second. And jump out. You are all. You're going. You don't have any issues. You don't have any issues. So why can't you hold this ship up? There's another one gone. Whoa. Well, we're getting a bit of welding done. Okay. Let's get some more done. It will go whoa. backwards. I just want to go down. Well, some of this stuff up. We're down to a hundred and eighty thousand kilos now. So, oops, we're getting stuff done, some stuff anyway. Let's have a look at our inventory. We have 2,818 steel plates left. And zero. All right, so we're done welding for today. But the ship is flyable now. Which is fantastic. All right, stop it. Go up, go up, go up. I don't get it. I mean, we're not that heavy. I need to put the, uh, the camera and I'm going to call it welder reverse camera. And I want that on my Toolbar. You. We have damaged the landing gear, but that's about it. With all those crashes, all we damaged was the landing gear. That's pretty impressive. Let's tilt over so we're kind of upright. Something like that. Let's come here. Let's go back. Um, back. There we go. Uh, lock. Charge. Turn off, turn off, turn off. And, and let's see the landing gear. Oh, it's completely gone. All right, well, we're going to have to build a new one of those. So, but I'll fix that up in between episodes, and I think I'll go fix up poor little fighter in between episodes as well. And then we'll be back in shape for the next one, I hope. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.